Partridge Watch. This is heavy. Now, today I'm going to be talking about a case that, you know, me and some members of the PIA have been discussing privately, watching to see what the verdict is going to be. What the verdict drop now. I talk about a man that called Robert Benoit. 59 years old, American citizen. He was found guilty by a jury right, after they agreed unanimously right, that he violated a 12 year old girl. Enough time on him to talk about them type of case. You see me covered many videos before. Robert Benoit, aka Robert Purvoir, is a regular visitor to Ironman. Now, look like people the things are the jerk chicken or keep bringing him back. Or the white sandy beaches keep bringing him back. Or maybe Pervo, like many others like him, realize say, right, them can get way easier with them activities on Ironman soil. Now, here's a little backstory. The mother of the girl used to work Pervo. She denies knowing about any of this by the way. So she never know any of this are going. On December 23rd, 2020, Pervo uh, visited the child's yard and was told by her father or the father tell the little girl when Pervo reached her, she had to spend the night with him. I want you to picture those scenes. So, the American, you know, Billy Joe reached the yard, and the father said, You have to stay here with him tonight. You know. He then gave the father a bottle of Magnum and left with the girl. Is that me? I read it? Uh uh, my first scratch me. But, student, that things have happened. Right. Matter of fact, most children who get, right, you know, violated get violated by somebody who them know often times a relative or something like that right. now if they're money you're certainly could pick me right as young as they want to be 7, 8, 9, whatever enough time let me say it's often a relative you know, some close money to them so now she's at the house because remember the father said she must go on and bring back the money and those are the exact words go on and bring back the money so basically when they see what I go on, I said, basically I trade the little girl right, for money. Right, they must sell her right, to your favorite Yankee. As she was at his house sleeping, she woke up to the feeling of Robert Pervo on top of her, right, violating her. So the next day, he was arrested and charged by the police. And I did seem fine guilty of after the verdict, right, this brother of the audacity for burst out, said, and I quote, it's because I'm white, end quote. You can't make this up. It's because I'm white. Pervo, you have mixed up Iron Man for Uncle Sam. Right, it's because they know what's sitting at the reverse, they could have said something like that. You know, Iron Man, that would actually help you, not hurt you. It's because I'm white. You, know. you see, just for that outburst, eh? the judge need for other than another five years. Just for himself, I right? It's because I'm white. See, you have a whole sad story online with him, Bilal Page. I said, this is because, you know, of his nationality and his color. And, you know, the Jamaican government and the JCF is conspiring against him to set him up and you know because them them take away him passport when right? they must say, you know, them attach him and pass the damn comfort. This man is so important, the JCF and the government come together, fight against him and them take away him passport. So he need a new passport, help him get a new passport so he can leave the country. Right. This is something where him now I try to use the seat to the man, keep me in the country, so that he can do this to me and do that to me. Right. When somebody gets arrested, right, it's very common for 
travel documents get seized and stop all and all kind of things. Trust me, Brevoir, you're not that special. Right. Even though people in Ironman probably made you feel that special, you're not. Right. The sad story, Mattel, not even 87s right, have them story to tell. Right. You see, I've said the whole thing about Joe is an American citizen. I know because as a Billy Joe is going through. That's what you say. Him really take Ironman people for fool. I maybe might say him take American to fool because how much them matter. Because Ironman people know say. Right. A country right, like our own that essentially right, relies heavily on tourism. Right. It would be madness for the government and the JCF and the citizens who are around targeting people because the white will lock them up and take out their passport right I mean them type of conspiracy there right would damage the precious tourism you no know? would not hurt the golden goose hey let's let's all come together and hunt down American citizens take out their passport beat them and torture them That's his defense. It's a grand conspiracy. Now, the girl's father is also before the courts. Right, from my reader, so, which right, is excellent. More people need to be before the courts. Right, so, when these things happen, right, when they actually catch the person who violated the pitney, right, they need to actually hold on upon the people them, who make them type of things that happen. People who facilitate this. Right, just like with crime in general, when you hold on upon the 87, you want to get right, the network around him. This man claims say fee mission to visiting Ironman so much was to hand out care packages. That's how he used to do it. Go to the community, hand out care packages. Here you go, here you go. We don't know my call it already. Charity tricks. The only stock pick in the book. How do you get somebody to let them get handled? You don't go in a community and say, hey, I'm going to jump on top of your 12 year wall. You don't see that. You turn up fresh off of the plane, you know, look a sun straw hat by your head, you know. You need to walk to the place, oh here's something for you, and something for you, and something like Oprah, you know, Oprah and Christmas and everybody gets something. You get something, you get something, everybody gets something. Nobody know where this man come from. People just see man at the place, I'm telling already. When it comes on to Billy Joe, nobody not really ask too much question because he can get the benefit of the doubt. If somebody in America want to help struggling black people, they don't need to leave America. Let me say that one more time. If somebody in America claims they want to help struggling black people, they don't need to leave America. America have plenty right, of struggling black people they can help. Right? And man, skip over how much states skip over here to skip over here so drop a iron man gone to a rural part you know, oh i'm just here to hand out your packages and help you i mean i'm not saying it's impossible i'm sure you know, lots of people have done that right and mean it but all i'm saying is you know, if you really want if you love black people so much and really want to help struggling black people you have struggling black people in your own country I'm just saying, I mean, you don't care about them, but you care about foreign struggling black people. Right, man left, man left Michigan, right, gone all the way, right, in a rural Uganda. Right, fly over thousands of struggling black people, gone to Uganda. I mean, as me say, enough people do it on a genuine thing, but I always wonder why. No, of course, I'm not against charity per se. But all I'm saying is, man, drop another place to they say, man, in come to save this and help this. The least you can do is ask some questions. Why here? You see, all I'm saying is, when it comes on to foreign countries, they have not itch, right, for them due diligence when it comes on to Ironman citizens. Right? Why are you here? Why do you want to come here? Who do you know here? Who will you be staying with? Right? Oh. We, we, we eat just like the food. There's lots of food at other places. I see them dig you up. Them on them them, 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 yeah, tell them something. And they might look on you like a unicorn meat. I try to sell you. 
And that's how it works when Iron Man citizen go to other countries. But when people drop an Iron Man, when Billy Joe drop an Iron Man, right, there, isn't, there isn't the same scrutiny. Man just in our community. And ever since my little youth, I go, makes you see this. Right, some random guy just but moving in a place, and nobody knows the question. Who that? Oh, that's Billy Joe, he just came here one day and said, I'm back in the country. Oh, next thing you must consider. These are the cases of people like this getting catch. That's like the money that I'm over here, I didn't catch him. These are the cases of who get catch. Imagine how many people like, are quote unquote, give out care packages and other things like this. Right. Imagine how many other Robert Perv were in the Iron Man. Enough time to believe like this and people reach out to me and share their own stories in their own communities and tell me, say, I see him say that one man fly down and people used to bring them Pitney guy in yard. Pitney used to get cussed, Pitney used to go in the yard. Right, and then come back and say, Mummy, I don't want to go back there. And then he used to cuss the Pitney if you go back. Sometimes people share these stories about some of these random quote unquote tours. I'm right. a kind of a shit man. Right. But if you as an Iron Man son, then you're going to hear it say, you, you need to be, you, you don't see that he gave out this cure package. Yeah, he, he, he's so good to us. But sometimes the same people, them, they actually open them eye with Russia for them precious baby Joe foreigner. Right. They don't care about the youths, they care about the things that they can get more than the youths. Right. More than their own children. Man basically a barter with your, with your child. Man come under disguise. Oh, I'm here to save you, smoke screen. Here is some free stuff. I, I mean, there's all these black people in my own country that I could give it to, but I want to give it to you in, in, in this random part of Westmoreland. Oh, by the way, nice daughter you have there, nice 10 year old. You want to trade? She's up here. Enough people that trade. More know what happened to that quote unquote father. And I'll keep up to a cipher and theme case. Though. Father. Quote unquote father. We're living in some spooky times. Right. Of course, you know them things they never get invented last week. This is not the first time these things will happen, but when you hear it, you have to just a look and a shake your head. So, let me say, we know people right, love Billy Drew and Greenwich and all the body come. Because, leave Billy alone! Yes, I know, enough people visit Iron Man and do quote unquote charity and it's genuine and you're not actually molesting no people. Yes, I know that. Okay. But that's not the point. The point is there's far too many using that smoke screen to hurt our children. But you don't care about our children. We know this. It's just proven this. You care about your favorite politician, you care about your favorite artist, you care about their children more than even your own. They can tell you uh, everything about them favorite artists, baby. Really. And bird they will school them with everything. Ask them what they want with me. They hear them and don't stammer. Me, 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 they live with me. Don't fool. Ask them what they neighbor. They don't know nothing. Anyway, Patreon Squad, big up on the cell. Yeah, yeah, you don't know. More life. Ultra Squad, stay circling. Bless.